Gentlemen, Antonio here. Seven steps to the best shave of your life. In today's video, guys, I'm gonna be talking, going through how to get the best shave out there. I'm not gonna talk about an economical shave. I'm not gonna talk about a practical shave. I'm gonna talk about the best shave that you can get. Now, many of you guys are wondering, Antonio, why, why take this route? Well, this weekend I had a great experience. I drove a Ferrari F430, and I can tell you it's not practical. It's not necessarily something I would do all the time, but it is an experience. It's an amazing experience. It's the, I mean, to go from point A to B, normally I'm driving a Chevy pickup truck that's almost 20 years old. I've got a, you know, we've got a minivan. We've got a Honda Odyssey. But I can tell you this Ferrari was an amazing experience. The point being, when you go for the best, when you look to take your experience up the next level, you all of a sudden start looking at different options, you look at different tools, you examine your routine and the way that you do things, and you look to improve them. Now, one of the products that is featured in this video is gonna be One Blade. They partnered with me on this video, guys, and I can tell you, I've been using this for 60 days. An amazing shaving experience. We'll talk about at the end of the video why it's such a unique blade and I think well worth your money. But I'm gonna link to them right over here, guys, and I want you to go check them out. I've got an amazing deal. But uh, right now, let's go ahead and let's get into the content of this video. Seven steps to the best shave of your life. Step number one, prepare the shaving surface. We want the skin to be well lubricated and your facial hair to be soft. To achieve this, Shave immediately after a warm shower or take the time to moisturize your face with a warm, wet towel prior to starting your shave. Ideally, you let the warm water do its job for one to two minutes. Next, we want to apply the pre-shave lotion. The goal here is to further soften the hair and provide the base surface over which the razor will glide using a high-end pre-shave lotion without oil. Although oil is popular, it can be difficult to clean off of a razor. Preparation of the shaving surface, aka your face, is one of the most important steps in a quality shave. Step number two, apply shaving cream. Most men use a poor quality shaving cream. The kind widely available in aerosol cans is full of chemicals. A quality shave cream should have simple ingredients. The first step in using a quality cream or soap is to build up a lather. A badger hair brush is the gold standard for shaving cream application. Now, the reason you want to use a brush instead of your hands is that it will better place the shaving cream on the face, especially at the base of the hairs. Step number three, the two minute wait. An often neglected step, the two minute wait, think of it as a recommendation for men who have extremely tough beards. I personally find this step a great time to multitask. Ideas for using the two minutes? Brush your teeth reading a quick book chapter, checking out what's new at Real Men Real Style via our free app. Step number four, choose your blade. Cartridge razors, they're fine if shaving is just something you gotta do. That was until now. For this demonstration, I'll be using the latest in shaving technology, the One Blade Razor. It's been my go-to razor ever since I received it two months ago. Think of the One Blade Razor as a straight razor shave that's easier and safer to use than an actual safety razor. Step number five, shave your face. All right, gents, time for the main attraction. First, shave with the grain. This means shaving in the direction your hair grows. The grain of growth is different though for every man out there, so you're gonna need to find it for you. When shaving, you wanna use short, small strokes. Most men overdo it and they try to take and shave too much. Follow this up with a quick cleaning of the razor. Third, shave with light pressure. Don't press the razor up against the body. Let the weight of the razor blade actually do the cutting. Fourth, try to avoid backtracking and shaving over the same area twice or even multiple times. This leads to razor burn. Finally, pay close attention to hard to shave areas. For me, this is up and around the neck. Now it's time to wash off your face and survey your work. Oh wait, you missed a few hairs and some hard to reach spots? Not to worry. That takes us to step number six. Step number six, reapply shaving cream and shave again. A huge misconception out there is that you only need one pass to get the perfect shave. Not the case, gentlemen. After your first rinse, identify areas where you missed patches of hair. Apply lather to those areas and go in for another round. For this video, I reshaved my entire face oftentimes against the grain. Finally, step number seven, 
post shaving care. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's rinse off your face with cool water. You wanna use cool water as it's gonna help close up the pores. Finally, you wanna use an aftershave lotion. There's a wide range of lotions out there, but I'm always looking for ones that have natural ingredients. Uh, either you're gonna see balms, you're gonna see lotions, you're gonna see gels. Find what works for you and go for it. All right, gentlemen, so hopefully you enjoyed that tutorial. I had a lot of fun going through it. And yes, I actually did shave in that video. So I noticed, I only think I had one tiny nick up there. See if you can go back and spot that. But guys, I know that I missed some things and maybe some of you guys have some shaving secrets that you wanna share. Let me know in the comments down below. And if you're interested in one plate, let me tell you. So for 60 days, I have been using this and it's an amazing experience. It's not a safety razor. It's not a straight razor. This is something that they spent millions of dollars. I, the, the story is amazing, and you can read more when I link to them right over here, guys. You can read the story and everything that goes into this. But we're talking over a million dollars of research that went into developing something that gives you a straight razor shave, but more. It, this is safer, safer than a safety razor. I know because sometimes I get a little bit careless. You guys probably noticed on my technique, I could improve a bit. But the point is, is this gives you an amazing shave. And if you've been looking for the Ferrari of razors, this is it. Guys, go check them out. I've got a great deal for you. And I will see you in the next video.